uh, in Manchester Airport, feeling very hungover. That music is horrendous. People are drinking whole pots of rose and James buying a bacon baguette. That's my morning so far. Off to meet Mark and Covent Garden, do a bit of birthday shopping. Hey subs, well, I've just seen Nadia's uh, Instagram post saying she has a terrible hangover and this is the unfairness of sober living guys. This is the unfairness. I feel like I have been drinking all night. I look like I've been drinking all night. I've either slept really well or slept really badly. I can never work out which. Anyway, I'm heading up to town to meet lovely Nads in Covent Garden where we're then gonna have to go our separate ways and solve birthday presents. I'm gonna be popping back into the white company. I'm gonna be popping into uh, free people. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna be stealthily trying to get her some prezzies today. She's stealthily me, us pretending to hide bags from each other. She's coming into London soon. Uh, the girls are at home, Nanny dies popping over later. It's Nadia's birthday tomorrow. But I feel like absolute shit. I've got huge headache on this side of my head. Anyway, um, the Prince Andrew story is rumbling, rumbling. It's in, on the front pages of all the papers, so I'm sure we're going to have more of a discussion about it later once Nads has had a chance to see it. Uh, keep putting your comments, though, down underneath our... Uh, my, I did a live chat about it. Really fascinating stuff from everyone, so keep going. It's, it's really interesting to read. Well, that was rather nice. We've survived it. Jane still looks bloody stunning. And we got an upgrade. A 40 minute flight upgrade. Nice though, we've got Ooh. a bit of breakfast. Secured my hangover. Proper cutlery and everything. Yeah, with the works. Champagne. Except we didn't drink it, we felt a wee oh. bit queasy. We had a bacon sandwich, it was all very lovely. Thank you very much, lovely man, who moved us to the front seats. We Tom love you very Spence. much. Thank you, Tom Thank you, Tom Spence. Spence. <laughs> I'm so pleased I've made it for Smith's Toys yeah. live show in Covent Garden. So it's it's what I live for. The five minutes time on that stage, is that right? That's up. Ooh, it feels so strange meeting Nadia in central London. I feel like we're going on a date. I feel like we're dating again. But she's coming to Covent Garden all the way from Heathrow. We've gone to Manchester. And oh, Covent Garden, quite deserted. Get into London early around Christmas. But I feel like a bit nervous. I feel like we're going on a date. So annoying. I've been trying to get ahead of the curve. Get into the shops before Nad's got here. Maybe snaffle a few kind of little gifts. None of the bloody shops open until noon. Is that always the case on a Sunday? Noon? What the hell's going on? How are you feeling? I love it, how gay is that? Yeah. <laughs> and it took ages to get here, hello, yeah, sub. And then the lifts weren't working, come on tubes, so it waited for ages. I couldn't, I was scared I was... I'd die. Oh my God. I was really scared. Oh yeah. I thought I could just like run my fingers over things I like here if you needed any help for birthday or Christmas. Okay. Go on then. Okay. As a rock chick vintage van. I want to start having rock chick eyes. I always like them when they get that rock chicky sort of thing about yeah, them. Yeah, I think I might go for that Chrissy Hind fucked up look as I get older. Yeah, no, I've seen you. Thank you, pardon. The climax, yeah. Sex on fire, ecstasy, pillow talk, first love. I like love, all of these. Love glow. I love Blimey, that's a lot of promise. It's a lot of promises. The, and a as bit as of you powder. put that on, does that happen? <laughs> nice little lunch out in Covent Garden. This is in um, the Peterborough Nurseries. This is Sky Dingle's Kitchen. Lovely. Is that nice? Gnocchi. Gnocchi. With what? I'll tell you what though, it needs salt. What are you waiting for? I think it's very odd to bring the meal without the potatoes. And every time the waiter asks me for it, I say, I'm waiting for the potatoes. She goes, yes, they're coming. At the cost of this is £28, this roast dinner. I thought I was going to get a whole chicken. I've got a chicken breast. You can get two from Sainsbury's. I don't, you know, let's see. Let's see how much longer we wait for the potatoes. I was expecting at least more than fish. Now that has cheered me up. Is it? That's a proper portion of roast potatoes. It is, isn't it? That's <gasps> more than your other plate. That's suddenly worth everything. Oh my god. Mm. You have to have some of them, Mark. I'm thinking of Maddie. 
lovely napkins. Oh, what's the purpose? The details and everything, the glasses. Look at this lovely mirror. We can't really show you the other side of the restaurant because we don't want to film people that might not want to be filmed. But it's so beautiful. It's like it's like a magical garden with chandeliers and ah. We've been waiting some time for the coffee. What's this here? What's the purpose? These are there? dark chocolate truffles. Did you really just say look at the oh fish? Oh my god, I totally thought it was a real fish. I thought it was a fish in with the jewellery. Check this out guys. There's your display cabinet. That's a real butterfly babe. <laughs> but it looks really real. Aren't those hearts nice? It's a real butterfly. Show them the fish. Huh? Show them the fish. Yeah. Hang on, there's a fish coming. Yeah. Fish. Look. Oh. Come on. That looks like a real fish. So when you come up, yeah, so you... <laughs> it looks like a real fish. And then he just disappeared. <laughs> like this. Yeah. So look, Mark, this is what I think I want to... I might want to have done for Christmas. To your ears? Yeah, she's like the best earrings ever. What, you want them all up your side of your yeah. ear? Yeah, I think I'm going to go for a rock chick for 2021. I think I'm going to wear leather boots, cohol. What? Cohol. What's all that? around my eyes. And you're gonna I'm not even joking. I'm going to get bone thin and I'm going to wear skinny leather trousers with big jackets. How many are you going to stop doing? I want to go... Mark, please don't keep that in. Mark, I mean it. It does though, doesn't it? Mark. It does, doesn't no! it? No! What do we think about this this model? The mannequin. She looks a bit gormless. Gormless. But um, isn't that dress amazing? Look at that for a Christmas party. Imagine if you had the sort of life where you need a dress like that for a Christmas party. It's not the kind of dress you rip off though, is it? It really is a case of why the long face, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Ages ago when we had those subs that were saying, um, Mark's sexual sexual references. Oh, it was on when we were on Facebook. Mark's sexual references are um, annoying a number of people on here. We've been having quite a discussion oh. about it. When was that? Years ago. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Well, I mean, if I... is doing, still doing exactly the same. Well, hey, there's a simple solution. I wouldn't go on about it. Do not put that in. <laughs> so we've just been for a, um, a meal. Basically, we are about to start reviewing restaurants for you. We're going to pay for everything ourselves. Uh, we'll be doing very expensive restaurants. We'll be doing dirt cheap restaurants. We'll be doing street food. We'll be doing market food. Will we food. ever be doing Five Guys we Name are gonna Joe? Be, yeah. We are going to be reviewing all kinds Excuse of me. food in all kinds of restaurants um, and we've just done one now we've just been to the petersham nurseries yeah and run uh, by sky gingle and our review will be going up pretty soon we've started recording on tape for the vlogs what you say i went to our last vlog and said what's your shoe size and all you said was depends well i'm never a five which is what you what you spent that enormous amount of money on in new york on those trainers i'm not a five right I can sometimes be a five and a half, but never a five. But ideally, I'm a small six. What's a small six? Well, some sizes come up big. I'm a small six. I don't know if I'd be Not okay with Not a big with that. six. I'm okay with that. Different shoes, don't the subs aren't different. See, different shoe shops sizes are different. Like, like it's like clothes shops. You can go into one shop and a size 12 won't go anywhere near your ass, and you go to another shop and it'd be too big. Talk about your ass again. Going off into Cobble Garden. Bye. Bye. Okay. I'm just waiting for you to go because I need to do some shopping. On, Your birthday. Go. You go. You go. I need to be in this area. You go. You go. Go. Um. No. Okay. So Nadia said not to record anything about this, but after eating at that lovely restaurant, which we're going to do a review of, I had to come to Itsu and fill up because I found myself wandering around getting lighter and lighter headed roaring rumbling the sound in my stomach and I realised I was hungry terrible isn't it
Oh, it's definitely me. I mean, that's, a, that's a picture of me. It's not a picture of I don't believe it's a picture of me in London. Because when I go out to when I go out in London, oh. I wear a suit. Oh my god! Top. That's what I would describe as those are my travelling clothes if I'm going to go. Oh my if I'm god! Going it's in suits. A I've got plenty of photographs of me Changing. dressed in, 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 in those sorts of that sort of <laughs> kit, but not there. Just to clarify, so you think that photo has been faked? I don't recollect that photo. Level cringe as much. much. And level cringe. Level cringe. Level cringe. Level cringe. Having your hand no. round her waist it's in so girly oh, outsmiles on Andrew. any occasion, even if it was a different day. So, I, 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 that, that's the best explanation I can give you. And then and I'm afraid to say that, that, that I don't believe that photo. See, pulling went there as a royal yeah. family. Yeah. That has been I'm sorry, why would... Because I'm just trying to understand. There's a photo inside Galen Maxwell's house. <laughs> Crazy. Galen herself is in the background. Why would people... Well, he's going to get ripped to shreds. I would have lost to explain. He's not... He's not this particular and the thing is, he could be subpoenaed um, now by yeah. the FBI. Yeah. You, he's not you can clever say enough for any of this. This is ridiculous. <laughs> Well, I think the date we have... I was in a McDonald's uh, in Croydon on that day. <laughs> <laughs> he does not say that. <laughs> oh, oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> oh. No. <laughs> no to all of it. All I'm thinking I wish. no to all of it. She's good. You she is good. You don't believe her. She's lying. To know, um, you are. Uh, what, what you are. But I do not remember a photograph being taken, oh and I've God. said consistently and um, and frequently. You could have had sex with that young woman or any young woman trafficked by Jeffrey Epstein. Believe me, made this sentence. No have to take some sort of positive okay. action. And so therefore, positive action, if I think he's talking you about. try well, I know what forget, he's talking about. it's very difficult to try and forget positive action. And I do not remember anything. I can't wrap my brain and thinking, oh, well, when the first allegations, when the allegations came out originally, I went, well, that's a bit strange. I don't remember this. Oh, I've been through, no! through it and through it over and over. Oh, and God. And it's so embarrassing. Nothing. It's so Mandy, embarrassing. Like for Britain. Absolutely. For Britain. Britain. <laughs> it's so rough. Exactly. The deposition said that you visited the Palm Beach residence around four times a year. You got a daily massage. Four times a year? That was what he said in a Florida court legal deposition. No. Oh, that's I'm just wondering, when you look Isn't back it? now, Why is there a rest? chance that those massages... Uh, his Palm Beach house, three or four times a year. Absolutely not. How many times would you say you visited? She's good. Yeah. Uh, in total, probably oh, four no, times. <laughs> yeah. Girl, this is like me lying about the dogs. No, it's about you lying about eating raisins. <laughs> look, 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 look. Yeah. Yeah. Well, probably that was the that was oh, the did place you eat all the that. that, that <laughs> and then that's the answer. Is in the house more more there than 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 other other places. I'm dying. Places I'm dying. I'm dying. Um, yeah, so I was sweating so much going, last night. I was going through and on it. somewhere Look. else. So it was. You could not spend time around Epstein and not know mm. what was going on. If you are um, somebody. Look, uh, the other aspect of this is that, is that, that so I live in, a, in, in, in an institution. Um, at Buckingham Palace, which has members of staff so walking nice. around. What did you think of our Prince Andrew just then? I was cringing so much. It was cringy, wasn't it? So cringy. It was like it was like a child in a headmaster's office. Yeah, I literally. That was me, like lying out of having stolen someone's pencil. Really. In primary school. Really. So embarrassing. So embarrassing, isn't it? I think you both got the nuance, you both could sense how embarrassing it was on yeah. such a microscopic... It was like a kid being found with jam all over his hands mm -hmm. and it all over his mouth and he's going, I didn't have any jam. And written his name on the wall with it.
I don't think I've ever seen such a cringe interview. No, no. No, but the funny thing was, when I went live last night, my armpits were so wet from sweating. Ugh. And he doesn't sweat. No, no he has a condition. Because he's been he's serving so the country. Right. <coughs> he was shot at. He's been serving the country and therefore he, he knows for a fact. But he does remember strange things, this man. Like he remembers going to Woking or Pizza Hut or somewhere. Pizza Express in Woking. I mean, he remembers... It's like so someone said, though. Nice. Have, Pizza Express must remember this visit in Woking. Yeah. It's not often you get a Prince Andrew coming in. Exactly. Have you heard? That now it's quick before it starts. It's you really can now get a sustainable right. um, toilet roll worth £33 wow. from Gwyneth Paltrow's Goop. I've got to have it. I'm toilet roll mad. I bet you you use them to clear up we're goop, missing, we're missing don't you? The oh, what's happening? I just saw Kate. Ah, I'm oh, missing it. Oh, in Cornwall, down. No, yeah, down. John Barrowman. Yeah, with his inflated head. Happy birthday, birthday to me. Someone else sing for you. Happy Let's... birthday, Dean and Nina. But I sing so beautifully. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Do you know what I think Maddie always says if you're just waiting and smiling? Yeah. Happy my birthday. My, my bag. I've got glasses in there. Yeah. You sat on my bag. <laughs> Nadia. Okay. Happy birthday to you. Thanks, babe. Read it out loud. Happy birthday. This card is the same colour as your pubes. <laughs> Thank you, babe. <laughs> I'm moved by the romance. <laughs> Can Mrs. Assist Mark? Good morning, morning darling. How are you? Morning. My baby girl, my firstborn, my first present, biggest present I ever got <laughs> in my whole life. <laughs> oh. Happy birthday. Thank you, darling. Did I nearly get a smile then. She went. Played a note inside. Couldn't resist having Mark. Love you. Oh, right. <laughs> Happy birthday. Yes. Exactly. He 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 thinks he's so <laughs> funny. I like this one from Jay. I like that one. <laughs> I like it more than Dad. Dad's oh, really? horrible. It's really horrible, Dad. It's horrible. I was going to try and cut one off though. and put it in it. Uh, but then I realised that would have ruined, it would have removed 20%, of it would have removed 20% of them. Can't, you can't put that in. <laughs> <laughs> Karma. Karma. Oh Karma. my God. Karma. Oh, happy birthday, birthday. Oh, I'm having happy green, green, green family sandwich. <laughs> oh no, it's going to Every time we come in here, I want this and I don't have it because it's fattening. But today, I can. What is it? Green cranberry. Nice birthday. Yeah, lovely. Oh. Again. Rude. Oh. Um. Are you having a nice birthday? I'm having a nice birthday. I'm having skinny flat white and water. Have you got girls? Ham and cheese toast. Ham and cheese. Look at their, their oh, hot gosh. chocolates though. Oh. Your hot chocolates overflowing. Oh, look at that. That's just like a melting pot of joy. And look at those in the middle just sitting there. Mm. That's pudding. Oh, oh look at all your cards. I'm so excited, a Christmas catalogue. A Christmas catalogue. Have a look. Oh my God, look. Ooh. Oh my, Sip, that's that bloody woman oh, you no, bought those awful pots, pots from. from. Oh, we don't want anything Chuck from it. her. Oh, Mark! Show us your cards. Oh, look. From Maddie. I really love With you. With beautiful words inside. I won't show you those. I love you. I love you from Kiki. Beautiful oh. words inside. It's from Jane Moore, from Mark, from Mark, Oops. from Nanny Di, oh, such a nanny. and from Mark's absolutely disgusting one. <laughs> absolutely not. <laughs> if 
first of all, look at this beautiful box. Ooh. Honestly, if you're wanting to buy something for somebody really special for Christmas, look. Look. Ooh. Look. How beautiful is that? Who got you this? I don't know, some weird fella. Ooh. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, they're very eminently Instagram Aren't they gorgeous? They? Gorgeous. Oh, it's almost like they thought of the colour of your hair. Oh my God, I love the colour of the box so much. Look, and you get that little extra oh. glasses case. Nice. No, I really, really love that. What else did you get? I love that colour. I'd like a sofa in that colour. Then, um, look at this gorgeous bag. Remember when we went to free people, sex? Yeah. And I said the things I liked. And Mark got them for me. Ooh. Look at this. I'll show you it properly on later yeah, yeah, yeah. before we go out. This gorgeous jacket, which you'll see on. And this gorgeous Whoa. jumper. How lovely so, is that? Jane so, Moore's going to be so jealous of my jumpers. So gorgeous. We have, we have jumper competitions, me and Jane Moore. And look at this. How beautiful is that? Look at Shooting that. star. Shooting star. Oh. And then... This, like, like I bought Lisa one of these, you know, my friend Lisa, ages ago, and I love it. I see it all the time on her finger. Mm -hmm. So he got oh, me one. Oh, yeah. Hang on, let me put it on here. He said better. just to take it in at any point. To... Oh, Stunning, nice. isn't it? Oh. So I'm very lucky girl. And Nanny Di got me a really odd, um, anatomically correct. Beautiful colour. <laughs> That's a brain. Yeah. And then she got me these. Oh, because you like the ones in the... I loved the one in the restaurant oh, yesterday. Oh, they're so pretty. So pretty. Oh, I love that colour. I love that one. Gorgeous. Yeah. I'm a very lucky girl. And Kiki got me earrings. Oh, yeah. Kiki got me earrings. And then Mark got this. Look, this is a beautiful bag. Look at this. Look at this. I thought this would be fun That's to do with the subs. play. play it with the subs. First world problems. First world problems. There's all sort of things like... Oh my God, you know, I asked for a coconut latte and I got a full fat milk latte. What's going to happen? I thought it'd be great to buy for Oh, my helicopter's 10 yes. minutes late. Yes, yeah, so, so for someone off the telly, it's about... Or oh, my mohair keeps getting in my eyeballs. Yeah, exactly. Or a seagull just shat in my guacamole. I, I did actually say one once and it was absolutely real. And my friend Miranda takes the piss out of me for it all the time. When I dipped my cashmere wrap into my miso soup, I said, oh, I can't believe it. I've just di dipped my cashmere wrap into my miso soup. She was like, oh my, my God. God, how first world problems is that? Here's Nanny Dye. Say hello, subs. Hop along. Yes, I was actually going to say to call her Hop along. And what are you going to say after hello, subs? I was going to say, it's very odd me coming up and downstairs and not saying hi, subs. Look what I'm getting Star Wars stamps. Oh. She's came in through the door. Oh. So exciting. So you've said that, and now you're saying goodbye, subs. Say goodbye, subs. Bye, subs. Did you enjoy Prince Andrew? Uh, what is it called? His private. His... It? How does he? What does he call an erection? See if you can remember. Have a go. Private function. No. No. Um, huh? um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> private function. No. I can't you're remember. Not... No. Have a go. Have a go. Have a go. It it does begin with a P, but it's not penis. No, I know it's not penis. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. Private, private, private function is so funny. It begins with a P. Oh, I've got that, but I, I'm never going to get this. You so will. Just give me more of a Okay, it's so opposite to negative. Positive action. Yeah. <laughs> I like that's private how, function. That's how the royal family have an erection. They call it a positive action. Yeah. Oh. So when they have brewer's droop, is that a negative action? I don't know. What does that mean a woman has? A woman well, has. Have... I wonder what I wonder what Prince Andrew calls a woman's positive action. Yeah, exactly. He probably never even considered a... it. No, of course he hasn't. <laughs> <laughs> you putting that on to go to the car, Mum? Yes, <laughs> basically yes. But you're going to take it off at the car. Shut up.
my blood boil to know that people don't see it. But those are mine, don't matter. Uh, uh, and those are matter, don't mind. I wish the world would realize that you're so, so kind. I love you unconditionally, even though you can annoy me the most. But I know that eventually, well, I'll want us to have you close. Mom, I'm sorry, I'm so done. Mom, I never want to lose you. Mom, you're the strongest person I know. Mom, I won't ever let you go. 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 <laughs> so I slipped off a few times. <laughs> You I wanted babe. to get you an actual no. thing, but I didn't. <laughs> what did you just say? That's your present. Yeah, that's your present. <laughs> that was rubbish. Yeah, I didn't, didn't hit the mask. That was rubbish. That was rubbish. Wasn't it? Yeah. Can't hold a tune, can you? No. It's, it's rubbish. <laughs> Tone deaf. Oh. Tone deaf, and that what was a rubbish beautiful, present. Beautiful, beautiful. What gift. a shit present. Oh. I'm in pieces. <laughs> Absolute pieces. Oh. Yeah, but I want to record both of because oh. I did yours I last know. year. Oh. I want to record both of your songs and like a right one's got Kiki. Yeah. But like make it a little family EP. Oh, family EP. Oh my God, oh my God. don't God. break my heart. Don't. I can't have it broken anymore. A family and Friends EP. <laughs> Even Toffee wants one. Oh yeah, you're not getting one. <laughs> <laughs> that was very beautiful, thank you. So beautiful. It really means an awful lot, thank you. Mm. As soon as you came in with a guitarist, I cried. <laughs> you haven't written me a song, have you? <laughs> you need to worry that there's like a sniper's target on your chest. Oh, Is that what? coming from outside? I just saw that. Is it? I just what? saw that. that. There's a sniper's target what on your hell? chest. Where's that come from? What the hell? Where is that coming from? Is there someone outside with like a laser? Oh, it's reflecting off of... It's the rainbow marks here. Oh, oh, God, oh thank me. God there's not a sniper in the garden trying to shoot me. God, we're such a dramatic family. Well, it's like that moment in... Is there, there a sniper round? in the garden trying to shoot me? <laughs> <laughs> We've just okay, discovered look. stuff. So you this know how I love this jumper? jumper? I love the colour. Yeah. I love the softness of it. But I've put it on and it's got this really weird edging. She's which I think sort of makes fat, me look enormous it because it, it Yeah, but I'm a fat, you, you believe differently to I don't think baggy clothes make people look big. So look on the side though. What do you but think? Look at this then. No, but it's isn't clear that, the, that that's not the body. Yeah. yeah. Isn't that the design? I like that cut, that's what I always wear. Okay. I'll keep it's it. It's really cool. It's really it's cool. like almost think of it like bats. Like the wings, yeah, like a bat. That yeah, like it's wings. got slightly wingy. It's meant to be winging. Okay, the label's out. I'm keeping it. You're not with the trend, babe. I'm trying now. I'm going to be a rock Basically, you're, you're a fruit Because mum thinks baggy clothes make people look bigger, but doesn't. It hides the yeah. outline of the figure. Yeah. That's why I wear baggy clothes. So this place is called Theo's. Pizza. Some pasty. Some I've gone for the... Uh, they have an unusual type of diet cake here. Okay, but no. I'm having a San Pellegrino limonata, which I've never had before, and it's jolly nice. Why we've come here is this is the talk of the town. Okay. Apparently, people come to this restaurant just for this chilli sauce. Now, we were reluctant to come here because we don't like places where we can't book. But we got here at six, and we're in, and there's loads of room. So there's I've seen a tip. people walking in off the street and walking out because <laughs> of that. You're suggesting we should try this. So Pizza, Mark once Pizza. made a program with uh, Carluccio, God rest his soul, and he made a fried pizza and you came home and you did nothing but talk about it for a couple of days. Yeah, I think I did. So we need to try it. No more than that. Oh, you put more in it. Idiot. I'm in on you. 
Robin's able to take chilies. Look at that. Go away. Yeah, but you put a whole dollop on. It burns a bit, but it's not. It's nice girl. thing your daughter's got really. She's got a good palate. I tell you what, Kiki's going to be an incredible cook. Wow. Dirty. What is it, a heart? It's a fried pizza. Oh. I'm going in. I don't hey, care. Excuse me. Everyone, survival Chili of the fittest. <laughs> How are your bat wings? <laughs> I can't remember Carlucci making these. Yeah, he did. You went on and on about it. I'll put that on Sunny in an Instagram video. Oh my god. Oh my god. Is that eat, eating savoury donut? Yeah. <coughs> Smart ass. Smart ass. You're not going to make 56. <laughs> oh, it's too much of that. I know, I just did it the wrong way round. What up your nose? <laughs> <laughs> so, Nads. Oh. We've just seen a We've play, seen called, a play Shook called Shook at the Southwark Playhouse. And it's everything that I love most about the theatre. I love really tiny theatres where you can almost smell the actors. And there's young actors literally spilling their guts, yeah. turning their own selves inside out to make you feel everything you could possibly feel. That is proper book, theatre. Book a ticket to see it. How good was it, Maddie? Amazing. I mean, what? It's I just mean, it's following three young men in prison. One of favorite. your faves. Yeah. yeah. Three young men in prison, and you know, there but for the grace of God, yeah. there but for the grace of God go any of us. If any of us had been given different circumstances for our birth, yeah. we could all be in that same situation. Yeah. But it's like, just the luck of our birth. Well, like Maddie said, three very different characters, and just all of them. Hard as nails on the outside in some ways, but soft, soft as, as soft as inside. goo in, inside. Oh, heartbreaking, heart. heartbreaking. Brilliant. Go and see it. Southwark Playhouse. Shook. On for a couple of weeks. <laughs>